Folks, folks, how you guys doing today? <laughs> today has been a good day. So, <clears throat> real quick, I know she is live. We will watch it. So, because um, apparently, uh, Rev tried to use the same little line. So, if you guys want to let her, uh, let people in her audience know that I'm streaming this, you definitely can. So, but first off, um, so I think there's a little discussion if his channel got yeeted. Uh, I know he hid his... Uh, GTV uh, network, so one of his other networks. I know he hit all the videos and stuff like that. Um, but I, I'm not exactly sure about the main channel. So I'm not 100% sure if that was actually taken down or not. I know that he had got a copyright strike and he could have took it, he could have private it just to save it. But it really doesn't save it, actually, because if you know anything about YouTube, um, the video is still there. So YouTube can still see the video. So if he private it, but didn't take down the videos. The copyright strike still goes through. <laughs> so, uh, but, um, 
How's everybody doing today? I am in a uh, super good mood today. I've been uh, really productive uh, at doing uh, certain things. Uh, I will let everyone know later what those things are. But this, uh, my wife actually got me this. This is uh, hashtag stay salty and I like it. But uh, another reason why I'm actually in a really good mood, this is an SL. This is an extra large. I, I haven't been able to fit into a extra large since high school. So I am actually really happy that I got to fit into this. Um, so I'm actually, it, yeah, yeah, he got spooked. So he, he took everything down. I think he, um, I think, think, I think it's private at this point. I don't think he got kicked off, but I think it's private. I think he's, he'll probably try to spin a narrative later. Um, so, cause you don't, you don't get kicked off the video that was struck was removed. So that video was removed. Then you don't get kicked off by one strike. You get a warning. Now, if you already had a warning and you got another strike, then you can't upload or do anything for about a week. And then it, it kind of continues on at, until the third strike. And then your channel gets taken down. So he had to private it. So, oh, thank you guys. Um, I'm not hitting the gym yet. I'm trying to get down to my goal weight before I start hitting the gym to be able to kind of like loosen any kind of um, tight skin or not loose skin or something like that. And then um, once I get done with that, then I'm going to actually fucking work on my tattoo. I'm hoping to get this finished up, uh, up into my chest. Uh, so that's bother the best, but thank you guys. But yeah, right now I don't think it, it, you don't get taken down for one strike against a video. You get a warning. And then it continues after that. So he most likely, if he already had a warning, he most likely just couldn't upload um, for a week. So he, I think he took him down to protect his channel. So, but yeah, you know, it is, it, it is. I do feel great. So, but we are uh, going to watch this because Shani was live. Um, oh God, that's so scary. Sorry. But, um, Drag was showing the channel does not exist, which means that it was not YouTube. Yeah. So uh, they'll tell you if it got yeeted off. Um, they'll, they'll actually say user uh, not here for YouTube violations kind of thing. So, but if you guys could check out in the description while I figured out what the fuck is going on here. Cause I want to. It has an issue with I'm trying to do live stuff. See, I can do I've this. I've noticed. Then I can you do can that. Take then a, it works. Uh, a bobby yep. pin mm -hmm. and scrape it down. Bobby pin. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm being a nurse. That's in there. I'm telling you. All right. So if you guys could check out in the description below, um, my cash app is dollar sign crude AF. Every little bit helps. Every little bit is uh, appreciated. Um, Jim and bought them pizzas. <laughs> Uh, but I also do step super chats. The super chats are great. Um, follow me on Twitter, TikTok, Instagram. I haven't been posted on Instagram in a while. I'll, I'll get I'll get right to it. So, I, uh, but um, yeah, everything's down below. So, if you guys want to join my memberships and you're on an iPhone, let me know. I can definitely shoot the link in in the chat because for some reason it's not there. She's trying to give beauty beauty advice. It's, oh God, we'll get into that. Too. Well, give me give me your phone. Let me let me let me go look. All right. Let's see if there's something in your ear. Okay. Fuck, I'm turning this off. Hold on. What? You want me to look? What, baby? Your ear? I don't know what's wrong with it. You want me to look into it? I, there's nothing in there. I'm telling you. Well, give me, give me your phone. Let me, let me, let me go look. All right. Let's see if there's something in your ear. Okay. Fuck, I'm turning this off. All right. I'm sorry, I'm being a nurse. That's not That's being a, a nurse, you dumbass. I'm telling you, there's nothing in there. What you could do? Yeah. Because we don't have cotton swabs. Yeah. You could take a... Um, a little piece of toilet paper. Well, no. You can take a, uh, a bobby pin mm -hmm. and scrape it down. A bobby pin? Yeah, let me see. Ow. No, don't stick things in your ear. Don't stick random things in your ear. You legit just said, I'm trying to be a nurse here. Here, stick a bobby pin down in your ear. Scrape it out. No. Oh my God. A bobby pin? Jesus Christ. Ow. Don't 
don't stick bobby pins in your ears, you idiots! Bending it down. Bending it down. Yeah, you're moving your neck away from me. Oh, he can't help that. He goes like, eh. Yeah, you got yeah. stuff in there. You end the top of your ear. Well, I know that I always get stuff in the top there. Yeah. All right, thank you. Here's the bobby pin. Are you kidding me, man? Try it. It's going to help. This is nursing advice, folks, from... I'm testing. Jesus takes the wheel, please, for the love of God. I'm testing to see something. Just continue on. The wart's still there. To all the faceless new names I see trying to get my goat and say I'm a hypocrite and say I'm the same as someone, no. I'm not. Yeah, you are. Uh, just because you have some retards on the internet uh, Jesus. telling you that I'm someone that I'm not doesn't mean what they say is true. Yeah, I mean, we got the receipts of the house and the abuse and the child neglect. We got all receipts. I mean, if people don't want to look at it, then that's their issue. Uh, they're just enabling you and supporting someone who does this thing. Several wars. Yes, all the wars are still there. It's because you have a bunch of people validating them. Over Folks, you're validating me. For what they say doesn't mean what they say is true. Because they've been doing this to me for 10 years. Correct. You might want to get to know me a little bit more before you open your fucking mouth. Ooh, Shady showed them. Fuck all them receipts. I'm just saying. Uh, I'm a very kind person. Nope. But I don't like being accused of things. It's not accused when it's not um, red. Yeah. That's all I have to say there. But if you're going to come in my channel and try to raise hell with me and try to accuse me of things, I'm going to block you. Because I don't like people calling me out on my bullshit because I'm a horrible person. Sorry. Simple as that. It. And I'm going to ask you a simple question. Who are you? Because I've never seen you before faceless. I'm Frank. I show my face. So, does it mean everything that I have said is true? Stroll? <laughs> I've never seen you before, so who are you? This stuff smells good. If you got... Oh. oh. Real quick, they, they, they don't promote me whatsoever or anything like that. But if you got, like, plugs, like, uh... Showed wrong here. Uh, gauged earrings like I do and stuff like that, get, get you some of this. This stuff is pretty good. If you can fucking see it. It's called ear butter. Uh, it smells good, too. Um... It actually helps if you want to uh, gauge up. Helps lose up the ear. So oh, I know. Random shit of the day. You're just probably the same person trying to start shit with me. Not me. I got yeah. tired of it. Uh. Good luck with that. I just wait until you go into other people's channel and they allow links to be shared. And not just share the link. <sighs> Check one, two, three, ten years. That's crazy. I know, man. My 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 beautiful friend Stacy here. She's been going through it for seven years. G man's in the chat right now with GTV Network. Shanny, have Rev call me. That's nuts. <laughs> uh, hold on, I'm gonna have to get the chat as long as no racial slurs start coming up because people are just uh just just having fun with G man right now. Hold on. People, they're, they're, they're trolling. You know what? No. I don't trust her chat. There's going to be some um, racial slurs coming up if, it don't, if they don't come from her. But no, people are going in there and uh, yeah. I don't understand why people are so obsessed with people that their intent is trying to destroy others. That's really dumb. 
seems like a waste of time. It's definitely... It wasn't a waste of time. It got your channel taken down, and you didn't get that 3K in Super Chats for um, profiting off of domestic abuse, child abuse, and everything else. Not loving your fellow man and his death. Ooh, 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 God, I'm going to be pausing this a lot. I don't love child neglectors. I'm just saying. Definitely not peaceful, so I don't vibe with that shit. You're not peaceful. Uh, you beat the shit I out of I vibe Rev. with real people. People who actually care about others. People who don't mess with people's heads. You don't care about anybody. That's who I What's am. What's up, James? What happened to G-Man's two channels? I guess those evil people got them taken down. I don't evil, know. Evil, evil. It wasn't because, you know, G-Man will go live and, you know, break terms of service or anything like that. Again, they didn't get taken down. He hit them. Um, it wasn't because of anything like that. I'm just saying. I don't know. I don't know. That's what you get when when you know people hold you accountable for the things that you say oh shit you're dealing with a bunch of psychopaths i guess people's channels get taken down because they don't want people to know what they're doing which was you know harassing others on the internet and cyber stalking them and they don't want to know the laws oh we know the law so they got the channel taken down because they don't want other people to know their rights. And they don't want other people to know what the laws are. I guess they don't want people to know what they're doing is illegal. And and they can get sued for it. I guess that's why they did what they did. <clears throat> now, here's the issue. You can take it illegally with YouTube if stuff happens. Like, say, someone is... Dotsing or actually showing pictures of your house and stuff like that. Kind of, almost kind of like uh, what happened with Steve McRae and Katie Joy. Steve McRae had this whole, like, what, group. Uh, someone actually took a shot of Steve, uh, Katie Joy's. Katie Joy's a horrible person. I'm not sticking up for her whatsoever. Just, she's a bitch. Uh, never liked her even when I helped produce um, non sequitur show. I never liked her. Just something rubbed me the wrong way. But they, he had a group. And people were going out and taking shots of her neighbor. That is stalking. That is cyber stalking because they're using ooh, uh, the net to stalk people. So stuff like that, definitely. Because Steve McRae got a restrict, got uh, hit with a restraining order with it. So um, that you can doing this, no, because this is a re just a response move. Also, it is not your right to be on YouTube. It is a privilege. I could be taken down right now and I can't say shit because, oh shit, they don't want me on the internet anymore. So, that's it. This is not some, like, slight against your freedom of speech or your First Amendment or some shit like that. It's a privilege. This is a private company. They are allowing you to do this. They can take that away. So... Oh, fuck. That was a, uh, whoever did that sock account was, oh, that was savage. I don't know. Shut up. Last man. time I checked up on G Man, he said he's going to buy me a pizza. So <laughs> I'm waiting on the pizza. Praise Jesus. Motherfucker, go out and get you a goddamn job. So. Here, the, how about this? Uh, I'll buy you a pizza if you um, stop telling lies. Mm, I don't have to ever buy a pizza. Because you know in 2020, 2021 America, folks, EBT don't last you the whole month. No. It don't. It does if you spend wisely. It can. Again, I've never been on EBT or anything like that. But I'm pretty sure you can make that stretch by not getting expensive stuff. So... Holy hell, I'll put you on my lifetime while you... <laughs> oh, thank you. So, um... So, yeah, I... I you can... I think... I'm, I'm not exactly 100% sure how much they get. I think they get uh, 700, maybe? I think they said it before. Uh, but, if you don't spend it on stupid shit, like... $7 for... What, 12 cans of... Um, 
Dr. Pepper, whatever. Five bucks for a whole pack of these and you get about 24 of these? These are good. Uh, it does if you cook from scratch, too. Uh, so, there you go. That's cutting cost. You pay about what? How, how much is Dr. Pepper for a case? I, I'm not exactly sure. But again, you don't get very much Dr. Pepper in a pack. Again, 24 of these motherfuckers. I'm good for the whole fucking month. And, and so, I also, to cut down on water costs, I actually went to uh, to the store and actually got a, you know the little uh, water dispensers that you can put one of the big jugs down on there? I got one of those too. Cut down on like a lot. One of those big jugs, like a gallon or more, is about six bucks. I, I get it maybe once every three weeks. Because that shit lasts, so. <laughs> Not with inflation. That's correct. Oh, but inflation is just a political tool, Shannon. Yeah, zero dollars for tap water, too. If the if their lines aren't broken. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's just a euphemism. It's just a euphemism. <laughs> oh, people got bonuses this month, too. Damn. It's just a euphemism for a bad economy, right, Joe? Who are you fucking kidding, dude? <laughs> Give me a break. What the fuck are you talking about? That just has, has nothing to do with Joe. Like, it's, what a joke. Anyone that says the truth gets destroyed, right? You guys so worried about G-Man, but the same people like to make fun of G-Man. I find that interesting. You worry about him, but yet... He... Oh, I don't worry about G-Man. I could give two shits or a fuck whatever happens to him. What's up, Brent? You, you make fun of him. I, I find that interesting. It makes sense. It's it's like it's it's like daddy took away your toy yes. that you like to play with and, and now you're sad because your toy's gone. Oh, I could care less if he's gone. Like legit. There is a, a <laughs> there's a bunch of people still on YouTube that I can easily just pick up. You go G Man goes. I still got Sagittarius Shoddy. I got Beauty Beauty. Oh, I got more. I got this cream on my back. Here is five. So, unlike Rev and Shani, you don't use an EBT card to buy foo asterisk asterisk ing lobster tails. You will never know oppression like them. <laughs> Thank you, Reed. Um, but again, I, I got plenty I can pull from. I just go for you guys because I like to save like Beauty Beauty, Sagittarius Shoddy, and stuff like that for edited videos. I haven't been able to do one in a while. I will start that back. Um, trying to get back in the swing of things after uh, the holidays. But um, I like to save you guys for lives because it's funny when I can just sit there and just do this live. So Field is full of cows. Exactly. Like there's people that are uh, like in uh, Black Guy TV's Discord and stuff like that being shared. I can easily pull one up. I still got Laura Moly Go Lightly. I haven't been on them in a while just because... Some of the stuff that they go through, it, it wears on me mentally just a bit. Especially with Laura, who likes to put uh, deceased children on her fucking candles. Um, some, some good did come out of all of that. So, um, I can't say much. But, some good did come out of all of that. Anyway. Uh, but, yeah. It's... I got many people I can pull from. I just like to go for you guys because it's familiar. I get a good laugh. I don't have to really prove anything anymore. You, fuck, you fucked your own reputation. I haven't done anything. I just showed people the proof and, or I showed the people the evidence. People come up with their own kind of thing. And then, woof. Yeah. You have to file tasks since the government has to have your current address and valid bank account in order to get to, uh, ooh, damn. Yeah. Well, you know what? I, I, mommy's going to tell you this. If you played with your toy a little bit better and took care of your toy and actually loved your toy, maybe your toy wouldn't be gone. That's correct. Who, who cares if G-Man's here? I don't care. Eh. Yep, we're going over to live right now. Or maybe you should stop looking at people as your playthings and start looking at them as humans. Mm, child abusers, child neglectors, and people who make up excuses for them. Mm -mm. Hey, April. You're not too late kind people i don't know i keep telling people to be kind but they they you start first disappoint me constantly <laughs> their kindness levels are like dead and i'm i'm just bewildered by the lack of kindness in this world 
Me too. I'm bewildered at... I don't know. It's in this world. I don't know. So, I couldn't hear it. I was just trying to listen. Um, do you mean any of you? Hey, hey, not exactly gone, uh, Fatima. Uh, but I couldn't hear it. But that little light is a little bit longer than it needs to light a cigarette. I don't know. It doesn't take you that long to um, light up a cigarette. I'm just saying. It's not 100% proof. It's not 100% proof, but. <laughs> 13, no, 13, no, no, no. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. So rough with the toy. I'm just saying. Did Rev get any? No. Amen. No, he didn't. What happened to Jimmy? I tell him channel? I have no idea. That's on him. To feed That's my fat business. ass. It's not mine. So I can look more and more like John you know? the Hutt. I'm Probably sorry, bad people. people did bad. How many Porcocept do you get for an old iPod? <laughs> Asking for a friend. Three silver dollars. <laughs> uh, here, I had it, had it, I had it large, but I'll, I, I shrinked it down so you guys can see that. Play all the horror games, nerd. I still have two that I have not even touched yet, like Granny Three and Iblis. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do that. I might, I might do that at some point. Um, add things to others, and and now. Wait a minute, who's? Izanda, happy birthday! Can we get a uh, birthday like little congratulations for Izanda in the chat, like little um, party streamers and and uh, cakes that they have it. They have nothing. Happy birthday! Well, you know, I mean, I can't do anything about it. I don't know. I'm just doing my own thing. In my own world, and 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 suffering every moment. Meaning she doesn't give a my shit. my waking breath. Shut the fuck up. You already, the doctor already said that it wasn't that bad. Like I legit have to take medicine so I don't tremor. I, uh, <laughs> what medicine? Which I am really bad today is tremoring. Really? That camera is really, really stable for someone who is tremoring today. I'm just saying. Um, normally, if you're tremoring, it kind of looks like this. Or I can't even do it like this. Oh, my goodness, a uh, tremor. Damn, that thing's fucking sturdy. I couldn't even shake it. Anyway, <laughs> like it was shaking the desk, not the camera. Um, Folks, if you guys want a good um, camera stand, let me know. <laughs> God damn, that was pretty good. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, that that phone is pretty fucking sturdy for someone who is trimmering. Trimmering means you're kind of shaking a bit like that. That phone is not going to be that steady. And I was trimmering last night. Could be withdrawals. Yeah. Said. Your hips. Yeah. Yeah. I never felt nothing like that. So you're tremoring in your hips, but your doctor said the hips wasn't that bad. All right. I don't know. I mean, this toy is breaking. Thank you, G. You're already broke. More than ways of one. You're broke, broke, and yeah. You expected a little bit more compassion for G? Oh, well, what do you want me to say? You broke the toy. Am I supposed to be happy about you breaking a toy? Am I supposed to be happy that you keep hurting someone? I mean, what do you want? You, you want me to have compassion? I have compassion for him. I don't have compassion for anybody that one neglects, uh, or not neglects, but um, enables and makes up uh, excuses for people like her who neglect children. And I don't have any compassion for anyone that will look up people's Social security, or not even look it up. Take people's social security that was given to them and use it and try to threaten people with it. Sorry. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see me in a chat. Probably not. I think she has me blocked. Nope, I'm blocked. Um, she's happy that about 70 people are watching. I don't know if she's still alive. 
Uh, let people know that I'm watching this right now. They don't have to give her a view. So, just saying. Oh. People he didn't lose his channel. He hit his channel. People like you who, who antagonize him daily, I really don't have compassion for... I have compassion for people who care about me. Yeah. No one... So you have compassion for people that enable your bad behavior. That's what that's what you're telling me right now. So, um, you don't you don't have compassion for anybody because as soon as they say something against you, oh, you guys are haters. But I I I ain't gonna assume what's going on with him either. I'm sorry I, for my lack of compassion. How about your lack of trying to screw and invalidate and manipulate people's feelings? How about you stop doing that? I, I would appreciate it. Wasn't that supposed to be about G-Man and not about her? I don't like being manipulated. I don't like my feelings manipulated. But you're fine with manipulating Rev. Oh, I know. They're losers. They can't help themselves. They have to trickle in little by little after I blocked all of them with their sock accounts and <laughs> pretending that... What pro G man did he get called out for his social security number crap? A pal. <laughs> well, how you doing, Fiona? Um, but not like again. Uh, Drag sent out a copyright strike, rightfully so, because G man was talking about doing the same to people. So you know, it's like, hey, I'm just going to do this to you, uh, because this was a straight upload and not an actual fair use. And uh, he hit everything. So, but uh, only thing that's broken, G man is. Is she's breaking them by making him work and going broke, I guess. I don't know. They know me when they really don't. Like, no one knows me unless you know me in real life. Let's just be honest. No one knows anyone until they really know them in real life, you know. Problem is, you let us know about you. Uh, you know, you, you get to see their <laughs> nuances and body language. Breathe the same air, you know what I mean? You know, you can only know someone so much over the internet. You know. <laughs> Remember when we met at the door, you're like, oh my god, you're real. Yeah. <laughs> that was cute. I was like, oh my god, you're real. And we started kissing each other's hands. It was really yeah, sweet. Yeah, we were just holding each other's hands so sweet. Like, that was real, man. <laughs> that was real. That was when you had 700k, too. And now look where you're at. Yeah, she's high as fuck right now. She, she seems like it. I love that. I love Smile, you you're on crew day up. Ah, yeah. oh, oh, Christian, that was good. <laughs> hug in a long time. A good one. Yeah. A good hug. A good hug. Yeah. Yeah, this is... This is, uh, uh, this is her live right now. <laughs> We're gonna speed it up just to have a bit. I feel you don't know anyone until you live with them. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's how you truly know someone is you live with them. Because oh, yeah. you see their bad moments, their good moments. Everything. How, a, how they are that, after taking a shit in a uh, shower. <laughs> there's a lot of those moments. <laughs> uh, you never, when you wake up and you see if someone's grumpy or not in the morning, that's, that's oh, when you yeah, know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, William. Oh, the foods? I think. The foods? How did me and Rev meet? Well, very similar how we're talking to right now. We met, we met on the internet. We met on YouTube. No one cares. And we were friends. The fuck is he yelling in the back? Do right now. We met. We met on the internet. We met on YouTube. Oh, he's okay. So he's probably called uh, G Man at that point and uh, second G Man's dirty dick. There you go. And we were friends for years on YouTube before we ever met each other in real life. Yep, and you cheated on Chris because you guys admitted to having phone sets and apparently he broke his phone by licking it that hard. And then we found each other, we met each other, and we just we couldn't quit each other after that. So, oh my God. Oh, Y'all can't quit each other. You got nowhere to go. A freaking fool. And that was wrong. What a man. Yes. Okay. Well, one minute, guys. Okay, we got an orange Fanta and we got a... 
Look at that sad sh Why do you need all four boxes in your room? That was all three boxes. Skipping ahead just a bit. All that food in their box. Gotta go pee. Okay. Okay. I think, am I on mute? Yes, I am. Uh, All right. You, are you don't have to announce. How are, how are uh, individuals? See, you came to Shani's channel. You don't want to see this individual. Yeah, he does. Everyone loves him. How we been, Negro? The fuck did he to say? Um, <laughs> I was about to answer a question and all of a sudden it just it fucking flew out with that. Uh, did Jane man bring him that or, uh, I think you bought it for him, but, um, what? <laughs> Any channel, you don't want to see this individual. Yeah, he does. Everyone loves him, baby. How we been, Negro? Oh, wow. See? See? You see how that happens? You say somebody's username and you're done. You're... You can... I can read the whole chat. Like, here, here, this is what's, uh, here, here, here's a good one. Did he say the N-word? Yes, he did. What? Yes. Told you. Yes. This, there is a troll account, uh, troll G-Man account that I heard. Yes. I didn't have to read any names at all. None. You chose to say that. You read that out. I didn't have to read any names. What the fuck, dude? It just, it just comes out that naturally, right? Didn't G-Man have that talk with you? Bad, bad rep. What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I can't, oh, dude. Yeah, they used a troll name, but they got him to say, that, say it. And he said it so easily. It was just like saying water. Well, actually, not uh, Dr. Pepper in their case. I'm from Nigeria. Why, that is true. What happens, you say somebody's username and you're done. You're from Nigeria. Why, that is true. This is accurate. I am from Nigeria, and, and, and I'm in the club, so to speak. You are not. You're white as fuck. White. What? They, they, they're going with that whole thing again. Like, Rev, that was racist, too. <laughs> It makes no fucking sense. Oh my god. Uh... My my genetics. Well, thank you for your love. Because I, I desperately... You're, you're white. Shut the fuck up. Really, like, really need some love. Because for the past three days, since... Well, look, Thanksgiving was amazing. Thanksgiving, like, we got we got some food from CPS. And it was awesome. Hi, Christina. God bless you. Uh, God's... What is it you guys say again? Uh, blessed be or something like that? Yeah. Whatever you say. I love you. God bless you. Oh, yeah. Hi, Rev. How's Yeti doing? It's good to see you. Well, the past three days, I've been pretty much starving. I'm going to be honest. Because EBT cards are not getting... They're just... They're not generating enough for us at this point. When you, you get $700. Like, I can... I barely spend... Oh. Like, that's sad. That is sad. Hold on, I'm going to have to rewind that. The past three days, I've been pretty much starving. I'm going to be honest. Because EBT cards are not getting... They're just, they're not generating enough for us at this point. When you got two growing boys, and that, they're priority number one. They got to eat. Let's be. Thank you very much. And that's, that's to you. Um, it's hard. So, this was a huge blessing sent, sent by our, our friend Gary. I call him Gary because he's a friend. You're not supposed to. Don't call him Gary. Okay? But oh. <laughs> Tell him not to call him that. And then proceeds to call him that. You're... Jason, it's just, you're, you're a gift to keep on giving. But uh, this is a huge blessing. And uh, it's good to see all you guys. Okay? One minute. Yeah, one sec.
Right, Shani has eaten seven hundred dollars EBT, so now they have to start. That is. Oh my god. Like I said, they could have they could cut down on a lot of stuff and make that seven hundred. Did Rev get any? No. No, he didn't. I tell him he must starve to feed my fat ass so I can look more and more like Java the Hut. I'm starving, folks. <laughs> Shani has eaten seven hundred dollars EBT, so now they starve. A fucking super chat notification is even funnier now for the sheer fact that he just said he's starving. Oh my god, that was great. I, oh, I love it. He's starving, folks. Sorry, that. All right, sorry about that. Mm. You told him we got food from CPS Rev. I'm gonna get. <laughs> Wait, when did he say that? Did he say that earlier? Cause I'm trying to, uh, or where did he actually say that? Cause I want, I want to grab that. We just spent 200 bucks and got enough to last until late December. Good grief! Right? If like again, like we make home cooked meals here. One reason why I'm, I'm dropping weight. Um, it's just it's giving me such bad heartburn. What is that? The lemonade? Yes, lemonade. Yeah. Like yeah. Yes, it did, G. Our wonderful brother. I love that guy. I do too. I think I gotta add it too. I'm gonna um <laughs> Oh, like in a minute ago? Fuck, I missed it then. Um But yeah. He's a great guy. His heart is just huge. Beautiful big cross on him. Love him. So how are you guys doing? I'm sorry. I have a migraine from hell. I oh, then get the fuck off of them. Like if I got a migraine, I, I don't get on a computer. Computer and phones make it worse. Like I don't do nothing but lay down. He said about two minutes ago. He said blessed be to the crib. Oh okay okay. Um. Yeah, I finish chatties. whatever's in here. Chatties. There we go. Yummy How am I feeling? Oh. Not good. She does look not bad. good. I have a migraine from hell. I keep getting tremors. Um, God, why can I hear you? Just not good. And the hubby, the hubby's happy. He's happy. Um, you know what? That piece is not going to help his heartburn whatsoever. <laughs> no, let me. Yeah, I'll take a. I'll take a piece. Cool. Maybe that'll help my headache. I don't know. It might. Sausage pizza. Mm. Mm. I don't care for the sausage. That was so good. Cool. Their sauce got sweeter. Did it? Mm-hmm. Mm. It's a sweeter sauce. Okay, Domino's. We haven't had Domino's in forever. Forever. <laughs> was it Colorado last time we had a Domino's? I think so. Mm. Yeah. Oh, you fucking pig. You'd love to see makeup looks for me? All right, two dice. Two dice, you stop that. Mm. Mm. I know you watch, you stop that. <laughs> or, or actually encourage that. I'll put it on a female salt mom. Vegetarian, folks. She's, I'm mostly vegan. Your mom had tremors? Yeah, it is bad when you have tremors. Hi, Gab. Um. Which one is your comment? Like, All you can do is take medicine for it and wait for them to stop. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> a Philly steak? I haven't had that in a while. Yeah, you so thought I'm... she was going to rehab. Am mm. I friends with Angie Lee? Why are you asking? Because she's a fucking nut. Are you wondering because of good intentions or bad intentions? She's a fucking nut. I'll watch some of her stuff. She is nutty as fuck. But yes, uh, I am friends with Angie Lee, and I love her very much. She's a sweetheart. They started buttering and putting like garlic powder on a crust. I noticed. Mm -hmm. I thought they've always done that. Uh, damn it! Big bag of macaroni, a big block of cheese, cauliflower, uh, flour, milk, butter, 
Big bag of rice, eggs, and a few veggies. I can feed. Exactly. Shani is great at evading channel bans and CP. I didn't get to see that. What was your uh, screen name, Billy? Usually you tets me. That's yummy. Oh my god, is that good? Good job, Domino's. Domino's is Will the cooking hot. streams ever come back? Nope. Well, I gotta work on my health first. You gotta have a pepperoni. I As she's scarfing down fucking pizza. There you go. I will. Kanji Lee is a cool lady. I like her too. I love her, man. She's she's a sweetheart. She tries to mind her own business and keep in her lane, but people keep trying to hurt her, and it's not fair. I feel bad for her. Oh, no, I didn't see it. I think you're blocked. Wow. Thought you were going to rehab. Shani said no, no, no. Was that a bad joke? Like Thank you, Jesus. Joke. These atheists will hate this. I know, man. Their 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 plans have been foiled. It's Christians taking care of each other. Yeah, that's oh, right. Oh no! Jesus you know that's what that's what Christians do. They take care of each other and love each other, regardless of circumstances. You know what you can also do? Get to uh, maybe not you because uh, no one's going to want to hire you unless you're customer support. Uh, but uh, tell Reb to get off his starving lazy ass and go get a job. So that's right. You tried that's copying me, did. but I failed. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, see, you are here to start trouble with Angie Lee. I'm well aware of her past and her reactions. You think I'm not aware of that? Fuck but Angie she Lee. she realized what she was doing was wrong. I'm not exactly sure what she was doing. And she stopped doing it. Hey, old bad, what's up? Oh, you're trying to tear See, your friendship apart. That's what good people do. They realize what they do is harming another person. Mm. And then they stop doing what they're doing so they don't harm the other person. Mm. That's something that you guys need to start learning nope. for yourself. Mm -hmm. Is that you're harming people with your gossip and your rumors. And you're not helping people. You're hurting it's not them. It's gossip and rumors. Learn to be better. Prove it was true. All of it was true. Your sausage got a lot better. Ah, uh, good for you, heretic. Shady, All right, stuff. bye, dude. I'm done with your bullshit. Take I ain't stuff. gonna be trolled by someone. You know, I've been doing this for 20 years. The whole so social media thing. Um, YouTube hasn't been around for 20 years. You can pick up a thing or two about people real quick and realize that they're lying or they're playing a card. Oh, there's a wild G-man on the phone. <laughs> I'll call you back. I'll call you back, dude. I'm streaming right now. I can't take two seconds to thank the person that just bought me pizza because I'm, a, I'm starving and I have no food in the house because I blew through $700 in EBT. Will do, G. 20-year YouTube fetters. <laughs> but I ain't, I ain't for that shit, man. You know? Yeah, trolls can leave, man. I love you, BBW, you gorgeous, gorgeous woman. She's You're a weird back one on too. American ground. Congratulations. <laughs> I would have stayed. <laughs> I would have stayed in Colombia. You can be half naked and no one cares. I'd love to spend the rest of my life on a nice beach. Just eating fruit whenever I can. Bet you don't eat fruit now. Fruit's cheaper than that fucking pizza. Like, legit, G-Man could have gave you the money. I don't think G-Man trusts him with money either. I think that's why he just brought out, just kind of bought them pizza. I think that's it. Uh, but uh, if you got the money, you could have got it like a week's worth of uh, food and some fruit. You don't eat fruit now. When's the last time you ate fruit that wasn't like maybe on a pizza or some like sweet dish? Like, get the fuck out of here. Oh. I don't know what a, what a Colombian is. Yeah. You're welcome. De nada. That's the only, that's the only Spanish you know. Mm. I don't Oh, I know. Your dual citizenship. <sighs> now that you married your husband in Colombia. Mm. Mm. So lucky. Oh. So lucky. Thank you, two guys. 
He's got a Columbia tattoo. Tell Rev to call me. Oh, cool. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. That was a lot of fire for that cigarette. <laughs> yeah, call him real quick. No, I think it's about the fake GTV. Huh? Oh. Yeah. We'll figure it out, man. Bacon is fruit. Go away, weirdo. You're a weirdo. Ugh. By the way, this is sped up. Now, now they're coming on my channel to hurt on G, man. And, and why are you, why are you, um, discriminating against the LGBT, dude? That's not, that's not welcome here. It's certainly not funny. Yeah, kind of like how you discriminate. I'm in the and I got this cream on my back. Trans. She needs the with a boat paddle treatment. Oh wait, she already looks that way. <laughs> kind of like how you was uh, trying to discriminate against uh, transgender people earlier. Uh, there's like point zero. <laughs> well, look, they're getting fruit because of the tomato sauce and the marinara and stuff like that. Now, that's that's how they're getting fruit. To go after the LGBT, like what what are you doing? Stop that! Damn. Oh yeah, she is. <laughs> Don't be going on my channel doing that stuff, man. Not good, man. Don't be mocking the LGBT. Says the person that allows her husband to say the F slur and all the other shit. Get the fuck out of here. Don't be doing that, man. Not welcome here. You know, people people don't need that, you know? And people don't need to be um, labeled to things that they're not. Aww. Like, <laughs> G-Man G is not gay at all. Yeah, no, he uh, he wants to cause harm to the people in the LGBTQ community. Because if you ever were out in public with him, you would see his eyes wandering to every like female that's attractive. He does look at other women. You know, he, I don't see him looking at men. I see him looking at women and turning his head at women. Hey, he loves women. Yes. That for a yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> She's learned. She's learned to cover her mouth when she mutes because I caught her uh, threatening her child the last time she muted and didn't cover her mouth. So that's funny. I don't know why she's getting because she's the one eating all the food. Lucy. Have the doctors figured out what's wrong yet? No, I have to wait for my doctor's appointment. Yeah. I thought you already figured it out. That's what you said the last time. Whoever asked that, that was that was really, really good because you just got her to admit that her other appointments might have been fake. Because they were supposed to have already figured out that she has osteoarthritis. And go away. I saw you yesterday on G-Man's channel and saw how cruel you were to him. I'm not for that, bro. You're not going to come on my channel and harass G through me. Animal Crossing? You want me to play Animal Crossing? Please, God. I no. could do that. It takes energy. <laughs> yeah, it does take energy. Which we've been lacking lately. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, that's why we need to go to the doctor. Mm -hmm. But I thought you already been to the doctor. Again, you are just telling on yourself today. We just need to go to a doctor. But you already been. Whoops. Hmm. Yeah. I see much better today. Okay. Whatever. I'm not well, okay. Player games takes. I'm just more talkative. Right? Hold on. Because I'm testing. Testing what? You got more than you did before. Yeah. Man, these people are so desperate. <laughs> for a reaction at the moment. It's so sad, man. It's so sad. And to all the new YouTubers out there, just know that these channels, they thrive off your angry <laughs> reactions. So don't give it to them. <clears throat> and they're gonna try to work you and press your buttons and crap. <clears throat> but it's all phony. You can press that button right there that's in the middle of her forehead and it just resets her. Bullshit. Because they are phonies. All the games are shit and Mm-hmm, yep. Oh, 
You can't see it right now, but I'm clenching this and just. I'm, I'm, mm, mm, mm. I know, and they're mad. They're mad that I'm not letting them get to me. Because I really don't care. No, I'm mad because you can't eat like a fucking, like. adult and just. Ugh. care anymore. I have more things in my life to worry about than what a bunch of frauds have to say who lie about others. Who lied? Like, when have I lied? I got nothing to say you. <laughs> and I'm done defending myself over lies. Because you can't keep up with your lies. Ooh, can't keep it up. Because <laughs> if you defend <laughs> lies that people try to throw you on the internet, they're going to use your statements against you and make you look like you're guilty when you're not. Well, you just admitted that you didn't go to the doctors. Like, legit. I mean, it's, it's not that hard. All you, have to, you, you, all you have to do is just play what she says. She will tell on herself. So. And, the only reason, and they do that by invalidating. By saying you're lying. You are lying. It's what they do. Yeah, I don't like you. Go away. Oh. I, I'm not stupid. Mm. I know when someone's trying to mock me. So, you can go away too. Because you're not productive. In my life, you're certainly not good for my mental health. And you're just a troublemaker looking for trouble. I don't want trouble. And I don't want your bullshit drama that you're trying to invent. Didn't you just... Try to do some drama today. Oops, wrong one. Um, I'm mad at a woman. Yep, there it is. There's, there's some drama right there. I'm mad at that woman. She's talking about beauty, beauty. Uh, lying to her audience, trying to collect sympathy, and then lying to her audience again. I don't like my emotions played with. I don't like liars. I don't know why you like yourself. Oh, wait, you don't. Um, and I don't like those that manipulate and lie to others for money. Uh, I'm surprised you still have an audience. Okay. Why is the, why is it only the liars, manipulators, and cruel that make money off of this platform? Again, going back to money, folks. She's counting people's pockets. So, uh, why do you, do people have a conscience? Like, what the fuck? Mm -mm -mm. All right. Um, let's see. What else? I have no idea who this is. They break the law every day. That looks like drama. Um, you don't look like that. Stop that. Um, trying to figure out some more. No, I'm saying it. That's not a, a, a vagina kink. God, you're fucking stupid. Uh, where is that one post? Where is it? Where is it? Ah, uh, did she take it down? She she, she didn't read. Oh, God, those eyes look scary. Um, she didn't read, like, an article, and she thought everybody was going to get taken down and lose their monetization, their, re their reaction channel. And But um, that wasn't drama. Mm. Uh, <laughs> I can't stand up fucking noise. Not into bullshit. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm too old. And I think this is something that you learn through age. That you ain't learned shit. You pick your battles. And you learn who to engage with and who not to engage with. I think I shall play some Animal Crossing today. I've been wanting to. It's fun. It's positive. I wish my headache would stop. Yeah, you can't play video games when you got headaches, man. No, migraines are too much. Yeah. Crap. I, I'm, I'm seriously doubting you got a migraine. Because in migraines, you won't be able to stare at a screen. Migraines, like screens, worse. Make migraines worse. The food didn't work with a migraine, so it has to be something that's not food related. Yeah, that's true. It's probably my period. Let's be honest. Period headaches. Oh, yeah. Period oh, headaches God are the damn worst. It. It's like flat out, like, you know those headaches that are right there? No one cares. There. Oh. Right there, that's what I have. So I'm not even going to waste my time with idiots. No. I don't got the energy, man. She is sped up. I just put her to two, like, sped her up to two, and she still sounds like she's talking normal. Oh. How high are you? Okay. Bad Jenny. Uh, period. That noise, too. that noise is our gum squishing a pizza. I'm prone to them. During my period. 
Can someone tell her to, if you're not in blocked in the chat, can someone tell her to blow her damn nose? All right. See, this is a constant. Yeah. It's pretty good. Man. Hey, that is a good beginning. What do you think? That is way better than good. Okay. Yeah, good. I just need a hundred more and I'll be just like the Nuge. That's true. That is true. That's true. What? I need some medical marijuana. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, while well, all you guys go and say I'm a drug addict for having it. <laughs> you already had some. We already caught it. <laughs> right on. Technically, maybe. <laughs> right on. Wasn't she? I don't know. I don't want to know, bro guy. I really don't. I know. I love how you guys try and, and pretend you actually care about me. And then you say the most obnoxious, stupid things. <laughs> ah! I know you don't give a fuck about me. Nope. The opposite. You want us on the street. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure your name is real Bob Bobberson. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you're a real person. Like Bill Williamson. Bill Williamson from Red Dead. <laughs> Folks, there's 229 of you guys here. If you guys could, maybe like this stream. Also, uh, again, Super Chats are welcome. Cash apps are welcome and stuff like that. But mainly like this stream up and share it out. Let people know that they don't have to watch her. <laughs> like, that's all they want. She smoked pot. She's a drug addict. I smoke mar medical marijuana to take pain away from my body. But okay. Accurate. Now they call me a pill popper for taking prescribed medications when I'm supposed to take it. No, we call you we call you drug seeking because you go to doctors and actually tell them I don't want this drug, I want this drug over here kind of thing. So, you you, you drug seeking. Hey, what's up, Sting Dog? <laughs> you see how they turn everything around and invert it to make you look bad, man? Yep. Now I have to repent. <laughs> okay, dude. You don't know how close to God Danny is, man. You have no idea. Uh, yeah, man. Okay. Look at all these stupid trolls, man. I'm tired of them. Go away. Go you find, go. go do something with your life. Uh, no. Ooh, I am. I am going out tonight with the family. Ooh. Unlike you, you don't do that shit, so. Go do something productive with your life. This is not productive. <laughs> this is you showing your ass and showing people how awful you are. True. How horrible garbage people you are. Try <laughs> Yeah, but... <laughs> <laughs> I see that. Be yeah, true. It's a boy. I will remove G-Man's channel myself. He who controls the YouTubes controls the world and what MRZ Parker did not tell you is we have control of someone who is very close, very close to G-Man. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's it. I'm gonna see how long it takes before you, get, your before you get yeeted. So. Best to tick someone off who's not getting ticked off. I just don't care, go away. Go mind your own business. Go do something with your life. And no you got yeeted, BB Truth. Amen. No one cares. <laughs> Bro, God, that totally no shit. one cares about fake people, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny as fuck. Bro, God, holy fuck. Come on! Come and get that! That's a boy! Dun, dun, dun! The person, this traitor, will be worth more to us than 10 legions of sheet ninja dragoons. <laughs> I won't tell you who the traitor is or how we attacked. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much, people, Thulu. Um. Um, if Rev is starving, imagine what the kids are going to... Uh, exactly. That is very troubling. So. You know, once I discover you're a fake, I just like, bye. Bye. I don't want fake people. Yeah, no, you was being nice. You said, honey, you was like, Shani, blow your nose, honey. No, just... I don't know. <laughs> Come on! Come and get that! It's a boy. It's a <laughs> However, G Man's channel will die before these eyes, and he'll know, he'll know, that it is I, Baron Dragnauction Silvers, who encompasses his doom. H A H A H A H A H A H A H A. Thank you. Uh, thank, uh, thank you so much, people, Thulu. You're awesome. Uh, now G Man is going to cancel Rev, right? Uh, pff, yeah, you yeah. hope. In my life, I want the real. I want the G Man was in that chat when he said that. I just realized that. G Man. Damn. You know? I can I I I I, I want authentic. I can give them a story to prove. Yeah. <laughs> really? I can. I'll put a story that that's about us. Yes, pr praise Yeshua Hamashiach. Amen. Lord of Lords, King of Kings. He is the king. No king but King Jesus. Amen. <laughs> so what's your story? Oh, I gotta tell them this. Okay. Alright, so I have no reason to lie about anything. Like Ooh, that was a lie right there. Like I love Shani, and, and to tell you the truth, if there was someone I would lie for, it's her. But I don't do that. I wouldn't even lie for her, really. I, I wouldn't lie. Then you just contradicted yourself. Like when he sped up, he sound he just just sounds like he's in on crack. Huh? Let's slow him down a bit. Right, exactly. 
it's 666 right at the top of our screen. That's like, okay, it changed. Thank you. Thank you to the new viewer, because that was kind of triggering for a second. Okay, so here's the story. So Shani and I had been together, man, I'm trying to think. I think it was going on about three months, right? And I had a night. It was one of the last nights that I drank, actually. It's, it's when the cops showed up here, okay? I, I was, I, okay, I got one of those medium sizes. It's about, I can't kind of, it's okay. It's one of the medium-sized bottles of uh, Jim, uh, Bean? Jim Bean rye. It was apple-flavored. Apple-flavored? Yeah. No, that wasn't the apple-flavored stuff. It was yeah, straight. Because I remember it sitting there on the porch in front of the cop. It was straight rye, I thought. No, it, it was, was apple-flavored? Apple it was. You See, I don't even remember apple. that, folks. But the thing is, here's, here's the thing. By the end of that night, I was in a chair, and she was pouring anointing oil over my head, right? Because that's, that's how demonic I was acting. And, and I'm going to tell you that this stuff is real because... I, I, I said to her, she got the tarot deck that we had in the house, because she's like, this is demonic stuff, this is demonic, and there's something going on with you. So she got the tarot deck from in, in the house. I was sitting on the back porch still with the freaking bottle, doing my thing and raging like a lunatic. And You do that. Yeah, like, like, like you rage now. And, and, and I'm like, you want to meet the devil? You got him right here. I was literally saying stuff like that. She got the tarot deck out, and she, she got the garbage can, and she was tearing all the cards up and throwing them in the garbage, right? And then I demonically got up out of the chair and I said, wait a minute, didn't you forget one? And I brought it out of my back pocket and it was the 9-11 card. It was the tower. I don't know how that happened, but it did. Okay? So she said, that's it. She got the anointing oil and she put it over my head. But the point of me telling you this story, it's a testimony to tell you all this stuff is real. <laughs> okay, the spiritual stuff, Jesus, Satan, the devil, all that stuff is very real. But aside from that bigger message, there's this message that, that she is telling you the truth that she'll drop you quick. Because she said to me, you're a fake, aren't you? I was watching you all these years on YouTube, thinking that you were this nice Christian guy. I was sitting in the sofa at that point. Like, I think that's around the time we decided to go to Colorado. Probably. Actually, it was near that, right? And that's when she told you um, to quit drinking, and you quit cold turkey, and she could have killed you. Yeah, I just a tarot, uh, a tarot deck doesn't do that. It's not demonic. God, fuck. Something like that, yeah. Um, she was ready to leave. And, and I saw it in her face. That's why it scared me so bad, because I did not want to lose her. But, but she did deliver me from that demonic spirit. But the point of the story is to tell you that she is for real. And just be nice to her, guys. Do you understand what I mean? Shani is one of the nicest women that you'll ever meet on the planet. But she doesn't take BS. And she certainly is not going to take just random people saying all these lies about her. So if you don't want to be blocked, if you want to have a channel to come and chat, that's awesome. We want you here. But just be nice to her. Pretty cool story, though. There you go. No, it's not. That, was, that sounded fabricated as fuck. Like... That, that sounded fake. There you go. <laughs> oh, you're gross. God. Ah, she looked in the mirror. I know, they're just gross, man. Whoop, 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 whoop. I saw a uh, flame right here. <laughs> Did Rev get any? No. I love the super chat. No, now. he didn't. I tell him he must starve Hail Satan. to feed my fat ass so I can look more and more like Java the Hutt. I'm starving, folks. Hail Satan. Tears of joy. Right, Black Eyed TV. Hail. Um, look at the side of, I think it's, yeah, this side of her face right here. Uh, you'll see, again, flames. You're gross. From a lighter. God. I know, they're just gross, man. I wonder if you can hear it now. Let's see. Oh. God. I know. They're just gross, man. Nope. Can't hear it, but you can see the flames. Oh, you heard it. him tapping it. I'm nice to Shani now. After I was mean, my life went to shit. I'm sorry, Janice. But I, I will say, don't touch God's anointed. Anointed, don't. I am not a cruel person. There you are. Man. They really don't have lives. It's so sad, man. I feel bad for you guys at this point. No, I do have a life. It's just everybody's asleep right now, so I figured I'd just come on here and just... All you me. random trolls hating on people, I feel bad, man. You, like, you spend your whole life... Waiting for someone to come online so you can bash them because there's nothing in your life worth saving, I guess. There's nothing like, like, you're only showing who you are as a person. BB Truth, I'm seeing how long your second account stays. You're, you're not showing me as a person. All, all people see is these random accusations thrown at me and, and see my behavior is opposite to what you say. So, whatever. 
<laughs> yeah, you got a bunch of gullible people right now. I was just like, I just wanted to like. He was cooking all. Protect him. I knew he was in just bad stuff at no, the I was, time. I was gonna die. You were gonna die. Yeah, hard, hard failure. And I didn't want to see you die. Yeah, it was I him. And I was a, a, a caretaker, and I, you know. I didn't want to see you die. I mean, I wouldn't be able to get the money. I've been trained in mental health. Yeah. And, and how to deal thought, with. Yeah. Thought, I was going there every day. Yeah, you were. Every day. Every day, dude. Every yeah. Every time. Yep. Yeah, man. God's anointed ain't nothing to mess with. No, right. it's not. Right. It's not like I. Like, What's rev tapping? It's it's a pipe or something. So. Like I feel bad for people who are messing with me because that's gonna come back to you, tenfold. Everything you do to me is gonna go back to you, and I, I feel sorry for you that you're gonna go through hell. I have mind powers, Black Guy TV. Go to sleep. I don't know. Because of it, like <laughs> it's not worth it. Like snapping back at people and. Treating people disrespectfully is just not worth the karma. You know, right now in my life, in my- Oh, karma hits you big. I walk, all I want to do is collect good karma. I just want to collect positivity and goodness and wholesomeness. Hey, you're doing not, a bad not job. Negativity because bad negativity job. is for people who don't know who they are, who don't care what anyone else is or who they are. You certainly don't care about their feelings. And all you're trying to do is, is put your own insecurities and what you hate about yourself onto others. Like it applies to them and maybe it doesn't. It probably doesn't. Yeah, it most likely doesn't. It's sad, man. Get all that uh, burnt up weed out of there. Man, if I was on my computer, it'd be like so much easier. Nah, it'd still make your headache worse. I know. I, 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 my, my test has proven correctly. You're right, yeah. See? See? And more will come Come on. Mm -hmm. See? I know. I know. They can't help it. <laughs> well, no, uh, yeah, so no, there, are, like, there are genuine people. Most yeah. of the people in my comment section, you know, that I keep. So the test is to see how many people, like, I guess, trolls and haters and stuff like that, would go to her channel. Shannon, I got you, you got 56 watching. I got 232. They're genuine and I love them. And the people that sum up your community. Yeah. You know. Yeah, man. I wasn't I'm not talking to you. Always trying to put someone on the defense. Always trying to put someone and shame them over their own words. Trying to silence them. It's pathetic at this point, man. Ambrose, yeah, you should be sleeping. <laughs> Always trying to harm people when they don't do and lie about people. It's okay. When the lawman comes, there's nothing you can do at this point. There's nothing you can do, you know, and the lawman is coming. What are you going to say? Stop making videos on her, guys. Jesus. Okay, I haven't done anything, so the lawman ain't coming. And then what are you going to do when the lawman comes? <laughs> Who are you going to do? Are you, are you going to keep up with the Shani Lies routine? Yeah, I can actually show you where all the stuff you did and then reasons why I make the video. And I'm pretty sure to be like, oh, God, she's a piece of shit. When the lawman comes, because I don't think it's going to work. Well, they got a problem. Because the lawmen are on our side. I know. Man. <laughs> they know what we go through because a lot of them go through it. Themselves. Yep. <laughs> They're sick of it, too. No, oh, I am going to focus on me, man. I was just making a test. I think I was successful at said test. Hell yeah, you were. Hell yeah, man. Big time. <laughs> I'm not worried about other people. Why do you think I'm blocking them? <laughs> Why she looks so dirty? She doesn't take a shower. Never takes a shower. <laughs> I don't care what they do. I'm just telling people, man, what they do. You know why? Because I can. Because people have to be aware and, and set themselves boundaries and realize that people aren't good. <laughs> a lot of people scammer. are there to take advantage Guy. of you and treat you like crap. Just, just so they can have an excuse to use it against you. It's pathetic. <laughs> I would love a good spa day. Ah, uh, you can't afford it. I know, baby. I swear to you, there were so many times. I'm like, I'm doing it. I'm getting for it. <laughs> hey, Rev, you know what's kind of cool? I can actually do that for my wife right now if I wanted to. My wife doesn't like spa days. Um, she doesn't like massages and stuff like that. So, uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I can do that if I wanted to. And it's COVID, isn't it? And they shut down. The spa is going to get you thing for it. Can I teach you to pray? No, it's not because of COVID. It's because you're broke. Shut the fuck up. Dude, you don't have to be taught how to pray. You just do, man. Just, just talk to God, dude. Just, like, like. Ellie Dean, you're a stalker talk to God too. Like you talk to anyone else. That's, that's all you have to do. You know, just be real with him. You don't have to do the oh, and, and and recite the same stupid thing that other people do. Don't do that. That he don't give a fuck about that shit. No. You know, just be real with him. Tell him your wants. Tell him what you're worried about. <laughs> tell him, him. Tell him. You know, <laughs> anything really. Just share your life with him. You'll know where he is. You'll know how to talk to him. I don't need to teach anyone how to pray. Because all it is is just talking to God, and he's always there. A spa day for Shannon would be like just taking her to um, 
Sea World and just trying to scrape the barnacles off. Shut up, Billy. <laughs> anyway, so it's like it's easy to do. Not complicated, talk to God. It's easy. You just have to believe and put the faith in. Because I will suggest, though, when you do pray, speak your words out loud for him to hear. Audibly speak them out when you talk to him. Because it takes an act of faith to speak the words out of your mouth compared to just it all being in your head. You know what I mean? So I suggest audibly speaking to him. And he'll answer your prayers because it takes faith. And he loves you showing your faith in him, man. He loves that. Yeah, the, the only thing I would add to that is that it probably wouldn't hurt things to start to put in the front of everything you say to him and our father. Because that is how he said to pray. Our, our father, father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. He said that. Yeah. He said that. You could call him our father. You could call him Abba. No, I mean, start it with the, our, our father. That's what I'm saying. Lord. And then tell him what you design your mind. Yeah. <clears throat> I guess that's good. Yeah. Because he said to do that. Like, direct it toward him. Of course. You got to put your energy toward him. It's okay. You'll get it. And when you finally find him. <laughs> when... Take it down to the fire department. Yep. Just, all right, full blast, folks. You finally re realize, oh, I am talking to him. It's so much easier after that. <laughs> like, it's so much easier. And he will listen to you. And I suggest also he'll listen to you. Oh my and God! In your heart. No offense to anybody who is Christian, my child. I just—it's just—it goes on and gone. This is sped up. Or he probably won't. Listen. The Bible says, and I've seen it come and go. I've seen it. Finally, you get a good foot bath going and some cucumbers on the eyes. Oh, that sounds good, man. She can't afford the cucumbers. But oh, where's she going to get the cucumbers from? She can't afford them. Put some pepperonis from the pizza on your eyes. That'll work better, I guess. <laughs> yeah, that's. I don't By your name alone, I'm blocking you, bro. That's just disrespectful to people who are autistic. Like, it's gross. It's gross. You guys are such ableists. It's so gross. Yeah. It's like, if they're not perfect in your eyes, you attack with such vitriol hatred. And it's such an immature, low level type thinking. And I'm, I'm just beyond that. You know, I think higher frequencies than that shit. Bitch, you thought the moon was a hologram. Shut the fuck up. Nah. Nah. Like not worth my time, man. Like Why does it always go by, go back to Nazi stuff? Thought you were going to rehab? Yeah. Do you know what rehab is? Do you know what a rehabilitation center is for people with osteoarthritis? I'm not going to be put away in two months in a place. No, you go to a place, and they help you exercise and stretch your muscles out and help you get more limber. Yeah. That's what rehab is for oh, me. Physical. But you haven't been. At all. Therapy. Not the same as rehab, Jesus. Ignore those gross trolls. Haven't accepted Jesus if they're treating people like this. Yeah, man. Right. Hey, what's up, uh, Monty? How you doing? Oh, shit. Why don't you work? Why are you here telling me what to do with my life? There you go. <laughs> she's, she's supposed to be on pretty much 24-7 bed rest, and that's, that's doctor's orders. But how is she supposed to go through rehabilitation if she's supposed to be on 24 hours bed rest from doctor's orders? Shani. Rev. It's that, like, again, it's that easy to catch you in a fucking lie. You, ju you just, you just have to wait and it just pops up. Leave me alone about my life, yo. It's yeah. none of your business. How about you focus on your life instead of focusing on my life? Focus on your problems. What are your problems in life? You should focus on that because something's telling me you're using me as a distraction to your own fucking problems. I suggest moving somewhere else. I don't care anymore. I don't care about the bullshit. I mean, they do realize that you would be hurting okay, yourself. Okay, okay, Jason. Thank you. Thank oh, he got shot down. What was he saying? Hold on. He got shot down real quick. I don't care about the bullshit. This is normal right now. I got her on regular speed. This is how slow she is. I mean, they do realize that you would be hurting okay, yourself. Okay, okay, Jason. Thank you. You do? Do they realize you'd be hurting yourself worse? Ah, oh, Jason. You're such a fucking idiot. <laughs> Thank you for sticking up for me. I don't need it though. I can handle it. Okay. Yeah, 24 hour bed rest is not good for arthritis related issues. Doctors would tell you to move as much as possible. I'm not a doctor. Uh, they tell you, I think what they said is, um, someone said it in my chat. Um, what was it? Uh, moving is the best kind of like uh, lubrication because sitting down. And it's just, yeah, no. Stop. Mm. I can handle it. She's in a real smug mood right now, but like, <sighs> why? I think they, I'm not 100% sure. And this is not for anybody to call CPS, but I think they had a visit for CPS. And then they got pizza, so. It's like, chill out. Oh, I have a fucking headache. Get the fuck I'm off. 
you're going to lay down. You're still alive at this point, I believe. Like, yes, because people are still getting yeeted. You're still alive. My head is just freaking pounding. Oh, my God. You know what doesn't help? Is when you're laying down, like, or sitting down like this, looking at the fucking phone. Here's the thing. If, like, and this is just from my days of uh, being a massage therapist. If all these muscles that are right here that are connected to the back of your head are really tight and you got a headache, that's not going to fucking help you. Leaning down and staring at a screen is not going to fucking help you. Shut the fuck up and go lay down. Oh. All right. I'm going to go, folks. Thank you for being part of my experiment. Thank you for watching me. Yeah, you can still see the lighter flashing. Thank you, husband, for sticking up for me. I love you. Oh. I, you're just saying way too many personal things, and I don't care. Oh, well, they do. <laughs> but I can't. That's hilarious. I don't want them to say anything personal to me, and I don't want to tell them anything personal either. Whatever. Ooh, we got a fight. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, I, I'd never agreed to this shanty Sunday slumber party, especially from people I don't know. Something tells me this is another plan people are having, and I just, I'm not going with other people's schemes or plans. Sorry. I'm not going to be the butt of your joke. You are already a joke. I, I, I just don't want it. <clears throat> I don't have the energy for it. Yeah, she could be dehydrated, too. I don't have the energy for most things anymore, and I, I certainly don't have it. To, to make this slumber party thing that I never agreed to. What? No. I like to keep my weekends usually by myself with my kids. I have plans with my sons anyway. That's a lie. What's up, mutant? On Sunday and this weekend. So there is not going to be a slumber party. Because I'm doing stuff with my sons. The fuck are you talking about slumber party? That was random. Is D-Man coming over to sleep with her or something? Yeah. Sorry. Okay, well, I don't know you guys. I don't know you guys. Whatever. I, I, I want to spend time with my sons on the weekend. Because they're usually really busy during the week. And I'm busy during the week. So I, I, I will put my focus on my children. My sons. <laughs> my teenagers, because I don't have any years left with them before they grow up and move out of my house and move away. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take advantage. Oh, I could, I could have made a joke. I'm not going to, I'm not going to. That was way too easy. <laughs> By the many years left, just not gonna, I'm not gonna go there. Of whatever time I have left with them, because they're growing up way too fast for my liking. <laughs> I'm sure Mama's gonna understand that. That my kids are growing way. It's kind of funny. Now you care since you have no money, but when you had money, you just shipped them off into your room. So then they pissed in the corner and stuff like that. And yeah, what was it? Um, filming in progress when one of them wanted to eat. Both of them are going to be taller than me soon. One of them is taller than me, which is just crazy because I'm really super tall. But I got nephilim in my blood. I think they're just huge, and. You got what in your blood? But I got Nephilim in my blood, I think. They're just huge. No, you got, like, grease butter in your blood. That's what that is. And... Oh. True, PG, true. Move away, she means take it away. Oh, get off yourself. You guys make shit up all the time, man. Go Whoa. away. Fit and curvy. Don't care. I hope you feel good. I hope, I hope you don't have oh. a you know, rat, bad reaction to it. Man, they're out today. You know, I, I should have listened to the warnings of the girls that are being targeted. Because you guys need something, something. And I'm not willing to give you anything. Targeted citizens. You know. Yeah, she thinks she's a giant. Uh, you know, I I don't care. I'll, I'm just, like, putting my arms out like Jesus and saying, whatever, dude. This is on you. Don't do that for long. You'll pass out from the lack of blood. This is on your own soul. This is your own judgment day. You're going to have to take account she did, for baby your words, she did. for your deeds, for everything you do to someone. You're going to have to take account for it. And I feel so sorry for you guys because it's not going to be a good day. A lot of you people are going to be on your knees crying. A lot of you guys... <laughs> I could have made a joke. Not going to. ...are, are not going to be able to handle yourselves in front of the living God. Because you know what you're doing is wrong. You guys are all adults. Playing pretend <laughs> and saying really cool things to people. <laughs> Fuck you, you know, I feel fun. sorry for you, man. You know, there's only so many warnings I can give someone about the inevitable, but it's like it's like you guys are looking for it. You're looking for trouble. You're looking for something. And I just don't have the energy for it. Or the want. Oh, nice. I don't know who you are, so you can go bye bye. 
Go Ooh. start trouble somewhere else, man. I'm not judging them. They condemn themselves, man. They condemn themselves, man. Just cruel people, man. In this world. No love in your hearts. Only condemnation and hate. <laughs> that was Sad, man. Sad. You can break through from this, man. You can be better than what you are. Living gourd. And you don't have to be hateful. You can transcend from that. Right, baby truth? All you told her was to blow her damn nose. Transcend from your judgmental attitude. Transcend from your condemnation toward others. Transcend. Damn. From making fun of others. You can do that. And you can be strong beings, man. Damn, you can be a lot stronger than what you are. She took, she took that to heart when you told her to blow her nose. Like, fuck. Because the more you're in this cycle <laughs> of negativity, Jesus. the more your life is going to be depressed. And I don't got time for that. I don't got time to be depressed. I don't got time to spend my whole life better. God, I got to skip this because I can't play my... Low vibrations in the world. Violin thing. I'm like, I don't care if you get mad at me for me being me. Like, you, you, you try to make it about you. I don't know who any of you people are to tell you the truth. I just see random names on the screen. A lot of random names, and then I'm expected to know everyone's intricacies. Uh, that requires sitting down and talking to someone. Face to face, you know? Heck, even DM in, a DM call, an Instagram call, a Facebook call. That would be a lot better than thinking that some <laughs> random name in the comments went to work with someone. Okay, Sid. I'm just saying. You know... I may not be a bowl of cherries all the time, but at least I'm real. No, you're a bowl. <laughs> at least I tell you how it is. You're a bowl of lard. That's all you are. Bowl of lard. Where? At least I'm not lying with a smile on my face and fooling you into thinking what I'm saying is right. You can think whatever you want. I don't give a fuck at the end of the day, man. Cool. You know? Pathetic. A lot of these people are pathetic. Can you so sad, man. So sad. And they just do nothing. Can you guys hear this? Let me know if you guys can hear this. Oh, you can hear it, because I see it going through. There we go. But believe lies about others instead of getting to know someone. I'm absolutely... And, and, and I guess g now with I can't play that too long. It's copyrighted. I didn't realize that. that. Not even close. I'm a woman who takes no bullshit, but I'm kind. And I'm graceful. And there you go. Lying to everybody. To their face. But I ain't gonna take bullshit, because it's childish. When I was a child... I thought as a child, I acted like a child. Transcend to the But when I became bitch. a woman, I put away childish things uh, and thought of the deeper things in life. Like love, forgiveness, mercy, hope. Those are the things that adults achieve for. Not middle school children tactics of trying to place someone down so you can feel better about yourself. Now, if you truly want to feel better about yourself, you're going to have to put the work in and be a better person. Because, see, if you put the work in to be a better person, you don't have to worry about this person says or this person says because you know the truth about you. But you are worried. Because you do worry about what they say. You know who you truly are. When you put away childish things like gossip and rumors and picking on individuals, that's when you can start speaking wisdom out of your mouth. And instead of putting people down who are struggling instead, you try to help them out instead. What wisdom have you spoken? Spoke, Shani. Nothing. And give them a little piece of your wisdom and impart it onto them so they don't have to do the stupid things you've done. I think it's it's good to learn from people's mistakes as well as making your own mistakes and learning from them. And I think that's what mistakes are for. Child to neglect is not a mistake. Not to ridicule, not, not to put someone down, but to learn from. Like, serious lesson. You fell down, so get back up. <laughs> <laughs> the jokes are there. The jokes are there. Uh, bitch, you can't get back up once you fall down. There. Bam. Got it. And got learn it from out. others. Got it out of my system. Hello, Irish Trish. How are you, gorgeous? Oh, we're getting close. We're How getting are close. You? So I suggest, if you truly care about someone, don't put them down from their mistakes. Help them grow from them. Help them learn from them. Um, the Native Americans have a practice when someone does a crime instead of... Toast. Where are you at, burnt toast? Burnt toast. <laughs> this is going to be bad. Like, like condemning them, they 
they give them positive affirmations and all surround them and hug them and make sure they feel loved and then give them a bath, you know, after them acknowledging what they did was wrong. And wasn't that another? That wasn't Native Americans, was it? Hey, sassy heathen, how you doing? But that wasn't. I I've seen I've seen something about that. That wasn't Native Americans. Where did I see that shit at? Hold on, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to look this up because that definitely and they I, move on with their life. Right. They don't they don't keep telling someone their mistake over and over again, trying to get a response, trying to get a reaction. They don't antagonize people that way. Instead, they embrace them, they love them, and they carry on for that person. You know, it's good. It's good to help people who have problems. You know, and it's good to recognize when someone makes a mistake. And and to did Rev get any? No. Oh. No, he didn't. I tell him he must starve to feed my fat ass, so I can look more and more like Java the Hut. I'm starving, folks. You have to have knowledge to impart wisdom. Shani can barely hold coherent sentences or thoughts, let alone evidence she knows anything. Again, I don't know if, if it was... a natural truth thing, but I, I've seen something where it's, it's not Native Americans. This she... Hold on. Okay, there we go. It was... What, baby? Your your one doesn't like you or does It was doing some Yeshua, weird thing. Jesus, he's coming back very soon, and I'll be damned if I if I get caught hurting my fellow man just for ego's sake. I'll be damned over that, man. I'm not doing it. So I'm learning how to forgive, how to give mercy, and how to mark and avoid for for my own sake, not for anyone else's sake. I guess it is for other people's sake though. When you're in peace with yourself, because you're no longer releasing your negativity and what you hate about yourself and you're not projecting yourself onto others instead you are light and and you're just shining light on others and just telling them to wake up wake the fuck up from your slumber you know i'm glad that i'm going through this i'm glad that i'm i'm going through everything i am and i'm learning everything that i am and i'm doing better you know i may not be the greatest health wise but morally no emotionally and spiritually i'm far more better than being reactive and allowing myself to be hurt <laughs> Make by Bravo's love. Oh, Lord. when it really doesn't mean anything because you should truly know who you are you should oh, know I forgot who to you are back up. first oh, no, before you judge others back up. Jesus Christ. and if you're judging others you don't really know yourself because you're projecting onto someone you're Shannon that's all you you can go lie all you want about me it's we got fine. 15, we got 15 more minutes folks I think we can I think we you're got this truthful. you lie you lie and you project and you accuse. Shani. Read that. Accuser of the brethren. Accusing day or night. You are f a fulfillment of scripture by accusing others. You're a fulfillment of scripture. And I thank you for being such a fulfillment. Because the more you wax worse and worse, the more I know the Lord is closer and closer. The more you wax worse and worse. The more you wax? We getting waxed up in this place? I mean, my hair, my, my legs ain't that hairy. Like, I'm not a hairy person. Besides, right here. We waxing anybody. We waxing, um, Billy. The more I know the Lord is closer and closer. So, guys, you hear that, right? The more you wax, the more she knows that God is closer and closer. So, if you get a Brazilian wax, God's going to be that more, much more, just be, be a whole, whole lot closer. I don't know. I was trying to come you up. You were God's something. compass and you don't even know it. You point north. You point north. So wax worse and worse. That's that's okay by me. Wax. You can, or you could be better than that. But you can wax worse and worse. And you can show me the day and time I'm in. You can She's saying wax. Oh, she's referring to waxing and waning. I didn't see I never heard of that. Okay. I, I, I'm, I'm, my brain went to like, like waxing. I, I don't know. Fuck. Show me that God is right there at the door, knocking, saying, "Let me in. I got something to show you." Wax it's okay. on, wax off, right? Mr. I know I'm nothing. What you guys say? I know it. Go away. You're called phony for a reason because you are phony. You're just a disappointing person. You're disappointing. You're just disappointing as a person. 
You know, you have this potential <laughs> right, to be Jesus. someone and to be in Christ in the right way. And you choose <laughs> to act and be. Fuck off with that, you know. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. Okay, so, yeah. Hey, look, and then... Like, I'll admit what I'm wrong. I'm sitting here thinking she's talking about, like, wax and, like, wax in her legs. But it's apparently it's a biblical thing, so... I, I can admit what I'm wrong. I just don't think it's there. Like, the godless. Go ahead. Have at them. But I will mark and avoid you. Because you're contentious and divisionary. Oh, no, I don't need we've you. been marked. I don't need you in my life. And I don't need your attention, either. Don't want your attention. You're giving us the attention. I, 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 I... I thrive off goodness and kindness of others. I thrive. You're thriving off the fat that you have right now. And somehow he's still getting fatter. I'm, I'm not. How, do, how are you doing that? When I'm at peace and when I'm happy, I do not thrive. But when you I'm haven't been happy. Cruelty. So I'm going to put the positive back in. Since you want to be low level thinking, since you want to have a low heart, you're definitely not thinking of Christ and what he commanded. Which is to love others as yourself and to love God. Those are so simple commandments. But yeah, it's hard for even Christians to do. It's sad. So I'm just going to continue to apply the Bible within my life. And do what the Lord instructs me to do and be wise. Because life and death is really held through the tongue. I'd rather breathe life than breathe death. When you're degraded someone, bashing per people, being passive aggressive to people, you ain't breathing life into them. You're breathing death. But if you listen to the instructions of the Bible and you're kind to others, you breathe life. When you mark and avoid those who are contentious and divisionary, you breathe life into them. Because you are teaching them not to behave unruly. Even Paul and Peter told people to shut up when they were being unruly, because that's not how a church should be conducted. Your life should not be conducted in negativity and hatred. Not how life is like. I hope you learn that someday. I hope all of you learn that someday. Because you're so much more than what you want to be. All that light you could have and could be sharing with others. All that love you could be sharing with others. And you choose to be contentious and divisionary. Nah. Don't want that in my life. I'll have my love. I'll have my love. I really truly do love my audience though. My loving, beautiful audience. My BBW420. And my Irish Trish. And my Stacy. Until they start you know, talking I love about you guys so you much. But Jeweled Christian, you're a beautiful person. Two Dice Dragons, you're a beautiful person. You know, anyone who isn't visionary and cruel, I love you guys so much. I really do. You're beautiful. You're beautiful souls. Who, Shannon Dickerson, I love you, girl. <laughs> Gingerbread, I love you. Because you make life worth living. You're positive lights in the world. And I, I, I want you to keep your life, Angie Lee, you too. Keep your light. Keep your love. Keep your grace. Keep your mercy. Keep doing you. Keep being that beautiful free light. Because drama's not the way. I mean, it's just a cheap thrill at the end of the day. And I'm not for cheap thrills. I don't want it. I mean, you can't ask for expensive thrills so cheap is where you gotta go. So much better than that. I, I, I certainly don't want to come to a point in my life where I'm like lying to my audience for views and money. You're lying now. Putting other people down for views and money. I mean, that's just a shallow, horrible way how to live. And I don't understand why people can't, like, see that themselves. And how they can wake up in the morning and look at themselves in the mirror. Maybe they do it by convincing that others are bad people. I don't know. You are a bad person. I don't know. I don't have to convince myself. Maybe they have to convince it. Hmm. Hmm. I ponder. Hmm. I ponder. Stop pondering. Stop it. I hope you guys can be better than what you are. I hope you transcend from acts of cruelty. I hope you stop following liars. Because a liar's path is a deadly path. A liar's path is a place of destruction. The only path that's a deadly path for you is keep eating those pizzas. And it makes me sad knowing people are like that, where they follow that way. Following the way of darkness. And destruction. Nah, uh, nah. Nah, I have a soul. I don't want my soul broken. You know, every time I was like reactive or, or cruel to someone or said something mean to someone, I always feel so bad afterwards. No, 
you fuck you didn't. You know, and I normally apologize. No, you didn't. You never apologize. We haven't. The only time you have ever apologized is because after you called us the N word, uh, you apologized then. But you never apologized for the other stuff. Never. Never apologize. Because I feel so bad for hurting someone. Like, how dare you, Shannon? How dare you? Oh, you never apologized when you left at our friend who uh, passed away. Or you hurt someone. I'm not doing it anymore. I can't do it anymore. It's not worth it. You rejoiced when um, a person called uh, Mo the Pagan passed away. Then you rejoiced when Trevor, our friend, passed away. So you keep doing the same thing. Love is the answer. Love is the greatest of all powers. You just have to believe it. You know, because love, if you truly love, man, you can quench the soul of anyone if you truly love. You, you, you can take the ugliness of a person and, and turn them soft with love. You can make an enemy into a friend with love. I guess you're not doing... Hey, you have no love, so I guess you're doing... Just a poor job. You certainly ain't making friends with hatred. It's not going to work that way. Um, I can't do it anymore. The contention. Nah. I'm better than that. Anyway. I think... My meds have kicked in. So I'm going to go and take a nap and go to sleep. Thank you, everyone, for... Say, Fiona, I'm still waiting for an apology after she called me a hypocrite for not defending her when I was too busy dealing with... Them. Yeah. Joining me and listening to my little acts of wisdom. Thank you for putting up with me and loving me and being there for me and being my friend. I appreciate the friendly words and the love. I appreciate that far greater than anything. But, but, call her out once and done. All right, that's it. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with this bullshit. All right. I thought we were going to get to other videos, but you know what? This was this was just as good. So, folks, I am going to take off here because I'm going to do some things real quick. Uh, but I do want to uh, thank you guys for coming out today. You guys have been awesome. That was an unexpected uh, live stream uh, watching. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. We will probably finish the peanut thing on Thursday tomorrow and we'll take a break. Um, but we'll finish the peanut thing on Thursday along with whatever Shandy does. And uh, yeah, so if you guys could uh, like this up, there's still about 200 of you guys here. Make sure you hit that like button on the way out. And I want to thank you guys for coming in today. I want to thank you guys for the likes. Thank you guys for the uh, super chat. You've been awesome. Uh, so, but yeah, you have a nice night. All right, you have a nice rest of your day. You guys are... Uh, just awesome people. So um, we will see you guys later. Ooh, outro.